Welcome to this DaVinci Resolve Fusion node breakdown. Today's node is the Mandelbrot node. So we're here in Fusion and we've got our little skater footage going on. And we're going to bring in the Mandelbrot node. And all this node really does is it generates uh, this pattern based off the uh, Mandelbrot fractal theory. And you really can't change the pattern. That's pretty much what you get. So let's jump into this node and see what we can actually do with it. Now up here in your generate, this is just your uh, generation of your image. You've got your position, X and Y. You've got your zoom and your escape limit that kind of controls the, the, the noise in it. Um, your iterations. It kind of determines the repetitiveness of it, and you can see it starts popping away. And your rotation. Now your next tab, the color tab, is where you can kind of uh, make changes to this. So you've got uh, two grad methods. One is continuous, and it kind of makes a uh, continuous gradient across the whole thing and iterations gives you iterations of a gradient you can see them in there so we'll leave this on continuous now your uh, red green and blue repetitions just basically change your color repetitions so you can dial something in that you want the uh, overall gradient curve up here will actually change the curve of the gradient. And then for each color, you also have phases. So we can change the phase of the red, the green, and the blue. So I know it's not that exciting, but uh, I'll show you some other transition type things you can do with this. So uh, let's go ahead and dial in some keyframes. And we will keyframe all this. And we'll start adding some changes. And I'm just doing them random. There's really no order to it. So we can see what we get. And so we got that. Exciting, huh? So, but to do something with this, what we could do is uh, we could get our handy dandy little dissolve node. Get some new footage. Trim her up. Look at our Mandelbrot and change to gradient wipe. Let's go back and make some uh, keyframes here. So now we've got this weird transition. And of course we can always blur it up. And if 
we want to go and make any changes, we can make changes here. We can change that to iterations. We can change our gradient. And that is the Mandelbrot node. I will see you in the next node breakdown.